Answering the internet's fifth most asked question about Neuralink. Why did the FDA reject Neuralink? In May 2023, the FDA has actually approved Neuralink to begin testing their brain chip implants in humans. Then in January 2024, Nolan Arbaugh, who has quadriplegia, made history by becoming the first participant in Neuralink's human trials. Nolan became paralyzed from the shoulders down after a freak accident eight years ago. By both Elon Musk and his own account, he underwent a successful surgery and is experiencing no ill effects. He even gave a live update telling the world that he could use his computer, play chess, and play a complex video game all with his mind. Prior to getting approval to implant this fantastic medical device in humans, Neuralink went through a lengthy review process with the FDA to ensure their devices were adequately tested both in the lab and in animals. Neuralink even went so far as to create fake brains, simulated brain environments, and tested in rats, pigs, sheep, and monkeys, prior to submitting hundreds of pages of documentation to the FDA. If you're intrigued and want to continue learning about Neuralink, check out this video where Nolan gives an update to the Neuralink team, thanking them for his implant.